everybody, my name is Ujelly, and today, let's play Paper Mario. In the last episode, we opened up a way to the volcano. Why am I not starting in front of the volcano? Because I forgot. <laughs> um, anyway, new recording session. Oh, man. Uh, not much has happened in between this recording session and the last recording session. Not that I can remember. Uh, there's probably something, and I can't remember it at all, and I'm being stupid. Anyway, we're inside the volcano! Walking down a big old hallway. Oh, cutscene. Identified as Mario! Alert! Report to boss! Alert! Alert! Okay. So, we've been spotted! Oh, hey look, it's Colorado. Hmm, it seems dan- I sense danger here. Well, you're standing next to a giant pool of lava. <laughs> All adventures are da adventures are dangerous, though, so what of it? Uh, I- we- we must press towards the glory of the unknown treasure! And now I'm on a rock. Oh god, why didn't I think this through? <laughs> yeah! What's wrong with this rock? It sank right into the lava! Well, let me show you how to do it. Move quickly! As you can see, there's no more blocks in front of us, except for the one that's slowly moving towards us. So yeah, this is a combination of waiting puzzles and jumping puzzles, I guess. And we're gonna be introduced to a new enemy right here. These are flamey thingies. I forget their real name. And I tripped into battle. But this is where things like Snowman Doll and the badge we got really become helpful. See, I'll show you. With the badge, we now do six damage with our hammer, which is kind of awesome. You can't belly flop on these guys because, well, they're giant flame balls. So, best idea is hit them with squirt. Which really means you're gonna be eating up FP in this chapter. Just no way around it. Uh. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Did, no, 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 no. I hit the wrong button. Yeah, so basically the attacks they do is they either try to hit your partner with little things of fire or you, or they'll jump on your head. I can't remember if they can summon more of themselves. My sister is doing something strange upstairs. Hopefully we aren't picking it up on the mic. <laughs> anyway, moving on. Uh, I don't really know why there's this little platform down here. <laughs> Just thought I'd point that out. Okay, here! I believe we need to jump off at one point or another. Oh god! Why would you do that? Introduction of a new enemy. These are buzzy beetles with spikes on their heads. Which makes them extra annoying. Like... It's a good idea to come in here with a lot of FP items, because you're going to be eating up your FP. Oh god, I did the wrong thing. I did something stupid. As you can see, they do a lot more damage than the original Buzzy Beetles, too. Which is to be expected. Anyway. God, that was stupid of me. I thought we were at a different part of the game where you do need to jump off at some point. Except now, we're stuck down here. Crap, and there's more Buzzy Beetles. More Buzzy Beetles! I don't like Buzzy Beetles! I'll probably come back in between the break or something and fight him. What's down over this way? What is down over this way? Oh! Save block. Man. We aren't even that far in! Why are you giving us a save block? <laughs> also, you might have noticed there's a block there that we can't break, so I bet you can guess what we're going to be getting in this chapter. That's right, a hammer upgrade. <laughs> I don't know why, I just decided, yeah, let's tell him anyway. Do we need a pow block? Yeah, let's get the... Oh no, I'm holding way too many items. Let's get rid of the tasty tonic. Because now I've got a super soda, which cures... Um that and also bu buzzy beetle buzzy beetle buzzy beetle you suck buzzy beetle you suck haha oh come on that didn't do anything god 
Must I do everything for myself around here? UNHOLY CHRISTMAS INSIDE A VOLCANO! There we go. <laughs> when, we, when we exited that battle, I was like, why is this stuff all the way over there? I mean... Like, when I killed him, I was standing here. The stuff should be over here. No, no, they explode out of the enemy's body. They don't just explode near you. Alright, and in through here. What's through here? What is through here? Oh, more of these things. I'm not gonna do the jumping over them 11 times. Because there's just way too many inside this volcano. But look, power up block! With this, you can upgrade party members. We're gonna wanna upgrade sushi. And I know that it would be probably, like, for the long haul, it'd be a better idea to upgrade either Bo or Watt. But for this chapter, you're gonna wanna fully upgrade sushi. Just because she does more damage, and because she gets an attack that'll become very- Ow! Very helpful. Why wasn't I spinning through this? <laughs> Great, I lost one health. I lost one health because I didn't spin. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, I'm done. Whatever that was. Alright, I think this is the one where we need to jump off it at a random point. Like, ah, missed! Missed! Oh, so bad I missed! Crap, where's the little thing to go up or no? No! No, no. Okay, let's try that again, now that we know where it is. Jumping! Aha! Fire shield! This means that you can jump on, um, uh, fire enemies. Okay, so it makes the damage takes from fire enemies go fr down by one. So, yeah, you can now jump on fire enemies. If you wear that. And I was already started talking in this battle. Snowman doll! Because I'm lazy. LAZY UNHOLY CHRISTMAS! Ah, oh, it does do six damage. Uh, oh, and this is a good way to- Well, we're not gonna show off Tidal Wave because... There's only one enemy. It would be pointless. That's an attack that atta attacks all enemies on screen. So, pretty awesome. Oh yeah, and just as a little spoiler sort of thing, kinda, I guess. Um, partners will not upgrade past two, so this is their final upgrade, the ultra rank. Um, I don't know if we're going the right direction first. Hmm. Oh well. Let's go over this way. Oh, uh, yes, we are. We are. I just realized we are. Another block blocking the way. Block? Why must you block the way? Anyway, uh, here we have a little lava puzzle. What you're gonna want to do is get out Parakari. Parakari, you and your evil mail delivery to the enemy. Actually, we're gonna wanna keep him out. No, 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 I said no. Okay, and you're gonna wanna push these blocks into the lava. It's just a simple little puzzle. I gotta come into these things more often with things to talk about, like just random things I wanna talk about. I saw a Penny Arcade comic where it was like the content filter for Mass Effect. Where, like, if you killed an enemy instead of blood coming out, it was, like, confetti. Am I the only one who wants that to be an actual game? <laughs> Where, and, like, it, he, as he was, like, killing the enemy, he said, YOUR MOTHER IS A CLASSY LADY! And I was just like, I would buy this game up in a second if it actually existed. <laughs> Not the Mass Effect game, the, um, content filtered version. Because, really, I'm not, like... I'm not a big shooter fan unless that shooter has something very different to it than every other shooter. Like, Bioshock. I am a big fan of Bioshock. And Metroid Prime I'm a big fan of just because, well, it's Samus. And actually, I've probably already given this away in this Let's Play, so I'll just talk about it. Yes, the next uh, Let's Play is going to be a, um, uh, a Let's Play of Metroid Prime Blind. So it's going to be my first Blind Let's Play, except I've played up to the second boss already. So, yeah, oh god, a red mage person thing. Lady, I forget what red mages do. I can't remember for the life of me what they do. Oh, holy Christmas! I almost forgot there. I'm sorry if you heard me hitting my mic there. I will probably edit that out in post. Here's a good time to show off Tidal Wave. Okay, you're just gonna wanna press the buttons in the order they appear. Oh god, hit it! Ah! I messed up. 
Oh, well, it still did a pretty fair amount of work. Now, mages, you notice, will run away if they have no other people with them, so you might want to kill them first, just so you can get the star points. Because they're cowards! 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 Stop following me! White mage on a broomstick. God, you, you, I'm just killing you fast. And, oh, I forgot to talk. I guess I'll just cut out that part where I was drinking the maple syrup. So anyway, in this box is the upgrade! Awesome. And now we can smash these blocks and our hammer power is now gone up a bit, which is really good since there's so many enemies in here we have to use our hammer on. Park Harry, you traitor, get out here and fly me across this lava. Now get back in the bag. All right. I really don't hate Park Harry that much. I just the mail thing. It, it's an ongoing joke that probably isn't that funny. I made myself sad. Um, I'm not gonna go over there yet because wait, wait, wait. I think I will go over there yet. I forget what's in this room. I think it's just a badge. Yes, Parakeri! Parakeri! Stay away from me, evil plant. I will make you fight some zombies. Dizzy stop! It's not really worth it. Um, ooh. Ooh, let's try this, let's try this, let's try this, let's try this, let's try this. Okay, Bombetta, you know what to do. Oh, come on, okay. Let's try this again, let's try this again. I know you can do this, Bombetta. Bombetta, Bombetta, focus. There you go. <laughs> ha ha! That worked better than I thought it would. I'm running out of unholy Christmases. I'm gonna have to actually do this the normal way. Sweet. All right, Park Harry. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Alright, moving along. God, I really should have thought of things to say before coming in here, because now I'm just sitting here like a dork and we're going up a long hallway. Am I the only one who thinks we should replace all stairs with ramps? I mean, you're still going to be going up them, but there's a less likely that people will fall off and kill themselves. And also, then we'll have more wheelchair racks with accessibility. All right, there we go. And I'm getting low on health. Oh well. And now we're in this room. Ooh, I don't like you. Oh, there's another power-up block in there. How the frick do I get to that? All right, now I'm really low on health. Also, I've noticed something. That spell lady isn't coming around. Did, she, did the spell wear off and I just like not notice completely? She's been really slacking off. I believe what we need to do is we need to go up to the upper floor and stop uh, and like drop down. So I'm going to go do that mostly because I want that power up. <clears throat> oh, hey, look, Colorado. My finely honed intuition tells me that a great discovery lies just beyond here. But this mysterious block is blocking the way. Curses, what to do? Yes, excellent. Now are you t now t time to hang about onward to glo I don't care. Can't read. Mm, it smells like treasure. Treasure, old boy. Make way. I'm going ahead. You didn't see the zip line immediately. Yeah. Immediately grab onto it because you know it's freaking zipline. Oh my god, how did I make that? <laughs> upgrade a party member. Yeah, let's upgrade one. Um. Bo. I closed my eyes and did that if you didn't realize. <laughs> Alright. And now Bo is upgraded Ultra Rank. Awesome. Oh, hey, look, Colorado. Oh, uh, don't mind me, Mario. I'm just investigating this floor a bit more closely. You go ahead. Oh, my aching. I'm just gonna go past him and see if there's anything else in here. Nope, this is just a room that we could fall into. Huh, I never realized that. 
I bet I've missed that power up block like a couple of times and just been like, eh, I missed one. Eh, I guess Goombario won't get his final upgrade. Eh, I don't really care. <laughs> I'm gonna try and get all of them just because, you know, it's the right thing to do. Alright, let's ride the zip line. And we're gonna stop here for this video, mostly because I don't like it when my videos go incredibly long. So if you liked this part, please subscribe. Um, if you already have subscribed, thank you. And I hope all of you have a lovely day.